Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. This is James, and I welcome you, welcome you all to my first video, and it is about Project Reality. You can see the version number down the bottom left corner. It is 1.3.8.0, and I will talk about how to set up your game, and uh, we will play. Uh, our first practice round in cooperative mode. Now, after you have successfully downloaded and installed Project Reality from Reality Mod, <coughs> the web page is uh, displayed in the description of the video. You have a few many options. You can start cooperative game right away. You can also join server via the internet and play deployment games. You can watch the perks where uh, you can have your replace store and there are the options. Here you can find your general game options and the most important thing. These are the controls just uh, general controls, land vehicle controls, aircraft, heli, boat. I <coughs> advise you to tune down the sensitivity of the mouse while you are in helicopter because <laughs> it can be really fatal when you touch your mouse while you are in the air. These are all defaults or at least mostly for me. I think the default options are absolutely clear and you can make do with them. Something came through as really annoying, like crouching or anything like that. You can either set a secondary key, like something, let's say, X. Well, of course, you can uh, get a warning if you have duplicate case, but uh, you can change like, here in the land vehicle. We can change our pop smoke to like B. Oh, <laughs> you cannot. Let us hit P. No. Well, oh, <laughs> finally something. But I think our default X is absolutely alright. So you can set up your controls whatever or whichever way you would like to use them. You can of course click the apply button. Or you can simply uh, reset all settings to default. Now, here is the audio menu. Well, I find that most effects are really loud compared to voices. Uh, I think the voiceover system, voiceover IP system is quite good in project reality generally, but uh, I think they need to be a bit louder than the effects. They are a bit more important, I think. You can always set up your uh, setting sliders separately, how loud you want to transmit or receive. And here you can start a microphone test to see if it does work or not. You have now learned about the options menu. And in the next part of the video, or in the second part, I will upload this separately, we will get right into a cooperative match and uh, learn about how to use this feature. James signing out. Goodbye.